Hi friends, I am speaking your friend Prabhu and now I am telling in this series of tutorial the one of the new concept how to set the primary key to key uh, to the uh, your database ID and the usernames anyone how to set the primary key to your uh, database okay uh, okay you to your table okay. okay now I am telling about that how to set the primary key uh, see already you have created that uh, table. Okay, so I am now I am told to you here I am uh, declare that um, database see data entry project of login window. So this data entry project of database here the data entry project of the login window table. Okay, this is login window table. Uh, this table having here yes, so not I am set to primary key here I am set the primary key. Okay, now I am show to you. Um, go to um, definition open definition okay so not having set to this primary key okay mm, but i am set to this login the primary key okay see having here okay now i am go to here primary key i am set here and then control s so coming like this message okay uh, you can't set that okay and then also i am go to the yeah, i am remove the primary key remove primary key okay and then also i am go to here in the login window and then go to table definition i am go to set here primary key here also and then control s or save here i am the save it's not save it okay so we want uh, we do not uh, did not that create that uh, uh, that primary key okay so how to create that primary key to this uh, I want to remove it remove and then okay okay why I am telling about this concept means one friend asking me uh, see oh, she shop insert thanks for a lot of this message not okay this may be see um, shohana for joy jensen and the set id as primary key in the database okay so how to set the uh, like this how to set the primary key to the database and that question asking me so the purpose i'm tell about that how to set the primary key okay okay friends now i'm go to how to set the primary key concept okay Okay friends, now I am telling about that how to set the primary key. First of all, you do, did not create the primary key to this data table. Why means having some data in this login window. Okay, so just I am going to show to you. Okay, some data is available in this uh, data base. Okay. So in this data table having some data, so same as same same name also available. Okay, you are using this primary key to this username means you can't create that same ID is having in this defaultly in before. Okay, if you have same ID in this uh, in your database means you can't create. Okay, uh, you have single separate separate user ID separate separate passwords uh, like this you and you have means the time only you can create uh, primary key okay or if you are create one new table okay add new table and then go to and declare here um, user id okay user id user id and declare here integer and then pass something and then and declare that we are there ok now I am control less save it now table 1 came and declare ok and then go to and set that user id pass uh, primary key now I am declare the primary key and then control s save it so can't save it ok why we want uh, we cannot save it ok why we cannot uh, that set the primary key so I am first of all go to that primary key 
to the management studio okay the sql microsoft sql server 2008 r2 and go to to this and then click and then go to click the sql server management studio okay now click the management studio sql server open here okay default and be given dot so it automatically the server name get here and then connect so the database open here okay and then also i am go to open this database and show to you the data entry database of tables and then login window and created table one okay this table one i am created now user id and password okay and go to set to this primary key okay go to design see having here the primary key just time um, go to set primary key primary key came here and then control s you can't create it control s okay now we have save it okay see i am um, also go to show to you save all okay now it save it why means i am go to show to you option and then designer we are having the prevent saving changes like this you are selected this one means click ok means just time um, go to remove this remove and then now i am go to set the primary key to this and then save it means it's saved okay now i am go to add one another table add new table now i am declare the id and then tab integer and then any one and then tab also any one as the like this okay now i am just to go to set to this sorry control s now first of all you are save it table one one okay and then click i am save it and then also i am go to set primary key and then control s save it means it's not save it okay why means once oh, defaultly you are save that uh, first of all you save it then after you set that primary key so that purpose is not created okay whenever you save it before you should set that uh, primary key okay uh, i am go to now save already i am save it this table in table 11 okay but um, after set uh, save it i am set the primary key okay I'm table created and then after save it uh, I'm set the primary key so that purpose the primary key uh, not set to this so that purpose the time you go to toolbox and then tools and then option and then go to designer and then here table database designer and then the, this prevent saving changes required table recreation okay this uncheck it and then click ok now you go to primary key set here remove and then set the primary key now go to save it it will be saved ok so it will be saved ok and then i go to close it it will be also save and close it ok ok uh, if you are created a new table ok again also i create one new table and then go to any one and then also here declare integer okay and then also any one and then also click integer or any worker also worker so where can I okay any one and declare and then go to before i'm save it then after i'm set the primary key so that was not set to that okay but i'm go to first of all um, before saving I'm set here um, set uh, primary key before saving okay so I'm going to set primary key it will be saved control s and then now I'm declare here one two it's okay means it's defaultly save it okay not uh, any recommended and then not comment to here okay it will be saved and then close it means it will be saved okay like this you can create the primary key 
ओके एंड देन आल्सो आई एम शो टू यू आई एम फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल गो टू सेव दैट लॉग इन विंडो एंड देन टू दिस आई वांट टू सेव दैट प्राइमरी की दिस टाइम गो टू प्राइमरी की एंड देन सेव इट द मैसेज केम हियर व्हाई मींस आई एम ऑलरेडी शो टू यू हियर the data table having same id okay same id available so that purpose we can't create that primary key okay just i'm go to remove this two id okay delete just i'm go to remove this three id okay just i'm go to copy and then run it i want to remove this Creating the time only you, you can create that. If you have a same ID in this uh, data table, means that time you can't create that login in those this table of uh, primary key you can't set here. Okay, so that purpose we should uh, remove this uh, same ID. Okay, the time only you can create. Okay, so just I'm go to create uh, remove this for twenty. Um, Yes, okay. So just copy and then go to declare here and declare that already delete query. So just given delete means it will be deleted. Double time confirmation. It's already I'm told to you. Okay, friends. Now I'm going to execute. So the login window. different id only available same id not available okay so now i'm going to create the primary key here okay now i'm going to save it this primary key it will be save okay now it save it okay okay friends see the symbol has been saved here okay okay friends uh, now i'm going to show to you here i am first of all go to insert uh Okay, now I'm told to use this one. Just I'm close it. Okay, I'm going to run it, and then how to set, uh, how to insert that uh, different ID. Okay, now I'm going to declare here uh, one name. So above, I'm set the primary key to username. Okay, I'm set the primary key to this username. Difference ID only available. Okay, not the same ID. So the purpose. Uh, created that see the primary key set to this okay and also this one uncheck it okay like this you can set the primary key okay now i'm going to different data i am save to uh, to this data table okay login window okay, i am go to proba and then and declare the password to this 1 2 3 4 5 like this and then go to insert means okay the proba came and then again uh, proba and then one three came okay and then also again same id insert it means it will be not save it why means i we are set that uh, primary key so you can't we can't save same name okay just save it this goes to error okay so see validations um primary key constraint p key login to this okay so we set that primary key to the login window see i'm show to here the login window login window of the data entry database no contribution so is a primary key okay save it so okay now we are set the primary key to this in this database so that purpose we are not uh, showing here okay, it's not a problem okay i am so to it's on created that uh, primary key okay okay friends uh, now again same i'm go to different uh id and created to this place okay just i'm go to here declare mohan mohan and then declare password any password okay and then go to insert admins 
it will be inserted and then again also i mean given inserted means it is not created why means the same id just time go to um, different id morgan or morgan or inserted means so different also be inserted the so mohan or and the morgan different data is inserted and then go to declare year um, year go p okay and then go to insert means so the go b also inserted okay again also go b yes dot s okay like this uh, inserted means so the go b s also inserted okay go b and go b s different id we should insert okay and then also you same id inserted means it go to error why okay, means the primary is same okay okay friends and tell about uh, first of all you whenever you are set the primary key that time you should uh, contain the data table uh, in empty datas okay null datas only available means that time only you can create the primary key if you are inserted any datas means first of all you should remove that all the copy datas okay this all the same datas you want to remove and then after only you can save the So you uh, after you want you can only uh, set the primary key means that time only you can set primary key okay if you have same data in this data table means you can't create that primary key uh, if whenever you remove the same data from the database that time only you can create that primary key okay or you can create that first of all you go to uh, create one table means that time before you should set the primary key then after save means it will be created first of all you save it then after you uh, first of all you save it that data table create and save it the data table then after you can set the primary key means it not possible so that time you go to management tool see uh, here having that management r2 and then go to here uh, the tools okay the tools available go to the tools connect and then go to the tools just to um, select the one database here yeah. table okay just to go to the tools design okay i am not set the primary key so just to uh, go to tools and then option and then go to designer double click and then table and then prevent uncheck it uncheck means then click okay means it will be created the primary key to this place okay you okay, can like this you can set the primary key okay okay friends uh, i am telling about how to set the primary key uh, to your database okay if you have any same data so you can create first of all you should create and then after set primary key then after only save it means the table you can create that you are can set the primary key to this uh, database okay to your uh, project database okay thank you friends if you have any doubt and then uh, any concept if you want to learn means just to command me and then send mail to me and then i will tell about that concept uh, by friend by friend now